What's going on? This is your boy KQKC Boston Network. And most likely, like always, we are working. And we are working right now. Of course, you know what to do. Before I get started, you need for to hit that like button. Make sure you hit that. And also, if you like to support the channel, new feature out called Super Thanks. And you can hit that to support the set of the, the, the channel, the grind, the network, and all of the above. The pay per view giveaways, the call in and fights, play by play, blow by blow. That's how you can donate. Now, also, I want to thank everybody, everybody for caring about my parents. Both, both of them is having it really, really hard. And I know a lot of parents, uh, people, parents are going through things. I get that. But not the way minds are. They're not doing what I'm doing. I'm talking about every day, 25 minutes per way, twice a day. Get home, do the live stream, do this, do that, do this and that. So I'm sorry. Yeah, everybody might be in my situation, but not doing the leg work I'm doing. Maybe it is some, but it's very few. Now, let's get into the video. Once again, thank you all. Now, let's get into the video. Now, we all seen today during a press conference in New York and how uh, pretty much Chance Crawford and Bud Crawford, uh, Chance Crawford and Earl Spence, they pretty much did not really, really, really go in like a press conference that we have seen in the past. Maybe because they're more mature. They know that fight is going to sell. They know that fight is going to sell well. But one thing about it, a side note. I wish not only these two, a lot of other fighters take up some type of public speaking. Bobak don't know what he was talking about. Oh, he was just saying, buy the fight, buy the fight. At least Derrick James broke down the fight or the fight turn in certain ways. You can be strong all you want to. But as Derrick James said, you have to look into the depth of it. That's the trainer. That's the trainer that breaks it down. Now, let me move on to what everybody been pretty much talking about today. Blue Blood Sports TV. And Earl Spence. Now, I rock with Blue. I do. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. We had, had conversations on the phone. I do. But y'all know I call balls and strikes, right? Y'all know I'm an independent thinker, right? I'm not a group thinker. I'm an individual thinker that's a part of a group. And you have to have that balance sometimes. Brothers and sisters, they always fight. But they still have that mutual respect. Oh, man, okay, you're going to tell it like it is. You might want to have a friend like me. Because I'm not going to sit there and say, hey, man, that's a good idea. Agree everything you're doing. No. I said, man, that's the dumbest idea I ever heard or or something like that. But some men are not real, real men. I'm sorry. I grew up in an area where my father was a man's man. And I was a man's man. I took care of mine. If I'm so slow and goofy, if I'm so slow and people take some advantage of me, I want to put three girls through college with their g- degrees. One, the youngest, she graduated a semester early. 
from college. The oldest one not only graduated from college, graduate school. She has a master's degree. Oh, I'm sorry. She also went to school and got her PhD. She's a doctor. So, not bad, poor guy. Wish I know it's a lie. That people say I'm slow or stupid or whatever. I knew that was a lie anyway. I knew it was another lie. When people say, oh, I had people, oh man, 25 people, 30 people. That was a lie too. Sometimes you gotta watch your surroundings. Real Spence watch your surroundings today. I told everyone, Earl Spence, I know for a fact, I know three other fighters that watches us. That watches us. Now I'm not talking about Bill Haney. Cause he goes on the platform to platform to platform to platform to support his son, which he should. That's his job. Now, as far as Blue concerned, yes, I'm sorry, I told you. Uh-uh, I don't want mine. Yes, Blue switched. Yes, he did. Now, of course, it was for business purposes. I guess it was. Well, it don't matter. I don't matter what it is. Say, look here. I'm about to go here and do this BLK Prime, which pretty much not doing nothing but giving backyard boxing um, um, parties. That's what I hear. Now, of course, uh, uh, um, sometimes you try to take the shortcut to get to the top. Well, you can't do that in this business. You know that. But no. All of a sudden, Blue lost all his big fish apparel. Now, if I'm not mistaken, he said when he got back, his wife threw it all away. All away. Wow. I wonder why. I wonder if it's the truth. But it's not my place. But I'm going to call balls and strikes. What Earl did today, he did the right thing. When Blue Blood asked him, if you haven't seen the tape, if you're new to this, you've been uh, asleep or a head on the rock. When Blue Blood asked Earl Spence, how you gonna do with the switching? From self on to or uh, 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 conventional? Or orthodox as y'all call it, the young people. And Earl said, I wanna ask you, how you dealing with the switching? So you switched from me to Terrence Crawford. You was all Bud Crawford at first, and now you're not. And I don't blame her. If you ride with me, ride with me. Once again, blue blood my guy. Sometimes it takes tough love. There's some people or some group of people don't want to do it. They'd rather go along to get along. I'm going to tell you the truth. Because you know what? I'm a man. That's why. I don't hate on my beautiful sisters. Like some people do. I don't rattle on about how sisters can be better. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to uplift my people. One way or another. And that's why Earl Spence said, you know what? Let me go and answer this. Let me go and answer this boy question. And that's what he did. Now, as far as Blue Blood saying that it's the suits that didn't let the fight happen. That's a lie. I know for a fact. I have definitely inside scoop. Now, I know we all said we know people and this and that. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Terrence Crawford wanted everything under the sink. And PBC couldn't give it to him. The numbers didn't match. The numbers didn't crunch. What he brought in, he didn't sell. So, of course not. And then, of course, well, how he get it done now? 
Well, I'll tell you how, how they got it done now. Earl Spence, Chance Crawford. First of all, they was already feeling a certain way because they seen the production of Ryan Garcia and Devontae Davis. They saw what they done. Now, they was kind of, you know, talking back and forth just a little bit. Not making no progress. But once they see no numbers, oh, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. That kind of like a boost their morale up between the two. And when Earl said that, hey, I had to let them know to make it happen. No. No. Because they were going to stand on it. They were going to give him what he's worth. Not a penny more, not a penny less. But Earl, Earl got tired of waiting. Not because he was bored, because he couldn't make the wait anymore. Stop blaming the suit. Stop hanging around Fred Hawthorne. He don't even like to be a black man. He don't even want to be a black man. Man, oh man, I wish I could show you that Christmas picture. Everybody at his house. His house now. And he's the only black male or black person or black period in there. And cheesing. I'm sorry. I'm for my people. Now, don't get it twisted. Racism is not allowed in my chat. You can't blame the white man for everything. You got to own up to your own responsibilities. When a man defends himself and constantly, constantly, constantly trying to defend themselves, then it's a problem. That means that, okay, yeah, I did wrong. I made a mistake. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that, making a mistake. We all make them. It's what you do after that mistake. We all know that Terrence don't care for you. That was the first time he actually, actually interviewed you. Or you interviewed him. He didn't never came on your show. Adrian Rona did. But we know where Adrian Rona head is at. So, and guess what happened to Adrian Rona? Hey, Christian Martin said, pack up, baby. We out of here. And then what he at? Don King. Now, I had to mold this over. You know, like I say, I rock with Blue. I don't have nothing to say bad about this guy. I don't. Because he never said nothing bad about me. And I told you, balls and strikes. Balls and strikes. Family go through things. See, I don't know. Maybe you know, maybe some of the LWC people need to take classes. I don't know. Cause it's all right to criticize your brother, your sister, but it's all in love. You know, it's not hate. It's just all in love. I wish I mean, really. And make that mandatory. You know, make it mandatory. But anyway, it, you know, hey. It ain't up to me, so. But, hey, like I'm saying, I'm just a squirrel trying to get not one nut, but three or four. Now, uh, 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 like I was saying, uh, 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 sometimes, you know, you, you gotta admit your wrongs. You gotta admit your mistakes. And don't worry. I already knew ahead of time that Blue Blood was gonna pretty much Cozy up to be LK Prime because of Bud Crawford. And they landed Bud Crawford. And I know Blue felt like he was above cloud number nine. I get that. You say, hey, this is a way to provide for my family. I get that. Hell, if I were you, Blue, I would say, you know what? Baby, we're on our way. But I can't get the life from me. Why people don't check before they get into something? Everybody in their mama is public record. Know that they filed six bankruptcies. 
That's all it would have took for me. That's all it would took for me. And a couple hundred dollars to get a lawyer to see why. And that's it. He could have done it right there in the office, right then and there. And now where are they? Where are they? And another thing, the so-called black-owned company, the one that Bud Crawford couldn't even spell or say, they not all black. They don't hire all black. They don't support all black. If they do, trust me, I'm surprised, it's a write-off. It's called a write-off. Now, once again, still in all, you always supposed to check into something before you get into something. Now, I don't know if he did or not. I'm just putting it out there. But if he did, I would have big, big, big time questions on all six bankruptcies. But after the fourth, I know him too. Ain't nothing else to talk about. It's time to move on. My time will come. Because Blue Blood, you great at you what you do. Now, you don't go as many fights as you used to. We all know that. But this was in your hometown, so of course you won't go to it. But still and all, Earl Spencer's right to check Blue Blood. If you ride with me, ride with me all the way. Say, hey, look here, Tans. I'm a partner of BLK Prime, and I represent them. And yes, I am a Bud Crawford, I mean, an Earl Spencer fan. Not that I'm a, uh, I used to be a real friend, friend, but I'll be yours today. How about that? No, no. I'm a Jamel Charlo fan. Win, lose, or draw. I'm still right with him. It doesn't matter. So, in closing, KQ gave his thoughts. And my thoughts is this. Earl Spencer's right. Earl Spencer's right. And Earl Spencer watched everything. Every movement. No, it was not the suits that stopped the fight. Stop saying that. PBC gave uh, Earl, I mean, I'm sorry. PBC gave Tan Bull Crawford the best that anybody can get. Especially with your uh, 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 so-called fans that you bring in, which is not really nowhere near Spencer's. So, yes, he did what he's supposed to do. One man confronted another man. So he changed his mind and said, you know what? I'm going to let him have this damn question so I get out of here. No, you know, look, y'all stop trying to sugarcoat shit and just put it like it is. Just put it like it is. Everybody, everybody, and they mama knows that my parents, both of them, are going through some rough times right now. But who have I heard from? Huh? <laughs> okay. But still, and I ain't answering for, hey, look, let me get this straight, I ain't answering for nobody for no sympathy. Oh, hell no. But one thing about KQKC, I rock with Blue, but if I'm a friend, you must tell the truth. If I'm a friend, I'm saying, no, nah, Blue, you, you, you didn't switch. Hell yeah, he did, y'all. Damn, y'all know it too. But only thing about it is, you don't have to be harsh about it. You don't have to get personal about it. This is boxing. This ain't the first, and it won't be the last. So, with that in mind, with that in mind, people, I'm sorry. 
if I hurt anyone's feelings. I'm sorry, but I'm an honest. I'm an honest person. Everybody knows that. No, I'm not a big channel. No, I'm not. But I tell you one thing, I'm an honest channel. I tell you one thing, if I'm wrong, I will say I was wrong. If I got a new car, I'm not going to brag about it. If I got new camera equipment, I'm not going to brag about it. See, one thing about it, one thing about it, if that was, it was so easy to send my daughter to college, the first one, we took that money, put it in a bond, that mature, man, there she go. But she surprised me because she had a scholarship. Free ride, baby, free ride. So, once again, in closing, KQ, KC gonna keep it real. This is a new day, baby. And like I told you all, I'm gonna start calling names. I don't make hate videos, and ain't gonna start now. Got Blue Blood Sports TV. It's a good dude. I have spoke to him personally. I just think he was mis misunderstood. I don't think he knew how to express himself the way he should have been. So, but it is what it is. So, I am KQ. KC Boxing Network. I come on Monday up through Friday. And that's 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. Now, tomorrow, all, all my people know I will be off tomorrow due to dad's appointment to get the surgery and everything set up for the pacemaker and everything. And I ask you, I, 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 I implore you and beg you to pray for him. Because when you're up in age like that, and you open your, you know, when you start opening up a person, heart, chest, whatever, you got to be careful. You got to be absolutely careful. So, so with that and said, with that said, thank you all. Thank you, BF TV. Thank you, 78 Sports TV. YouTube has always been there for me. YouTube always supported me. YouTube, YouTube, not YouTube, but YouTube has been there. Yeah, you might not be there long, but at least you came through, hit the like button, and salute to me and everybody else. So, one thing about it, to me, this is my dude. And that what drew me into the LDBC. And what they stood for. The black fighter. But times have changed. They took off the hood, yeah. They took them off. But then they got on the suits. They got on the suits. So, with that, I'm out of here. Peace and love to everybody. I greet you with the ancient word of peace. And that's assalamu alaikum. <laughs> and you also go in peace and have a great night. All right? Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu I do Allah, the magnificent and the merciful. May he bless you and keep you. And with that, I'll see you on Friday, y'all. Y'all have a good one. Peace.